Good morning, Eagles. I'm Annie. And I'm Sebastian. And we're reporting to you live from WSJN News Headquarters. Today, we have Terranova testing. Seba, I'm so glad we're reporting together because we're a gathered as two. Well, Annie, I'm charmed. But why is it so important? In the Gospel of Matthew, Jesus tells us that wherever two or three are gathered in his name, he is there among them. Yeah, that is a pretty big promise. So, Jesus is here right now. That means that Jesus is with us anytime with others. For example, he is with us when we're in the car on our way to school in the morning. Yeah, as long as you're gathered in Jesus' name, you can be in the car on the way to school for 15, 30, or even 45 minutes. That's a lot of time in the car. Invite God to join you in your commute to school. He will be with you in those drives and he uses every second. This week, look at every minute spent with followers of Christ as a chance to invite Jesus to join you, even if it means like nothing is really going on. No matter where we are or what we are doing, Jesus will join us and make that moment a billion times better. Please stand, Please stand for, for prayers. prayers. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, Amen. O oh my God, I firmly believe that you are one God in three divine persons, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. I believe that you, the divine Son, became man and died for our sins, and that he will come to judge the living and the dead. I believe these and all the truths which the Holy Catholic Church teaches, because in revealing them, you can neither deceive nor be deceived. Amen. Please remain standing for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. to Jake Lopez in second grade and Gianna Rodriguez in third grade. Tomorrow we wish a happy birthday to George Vienna in seventh grade. Happy, happy birthday, birthday Jake, Jake, Gianna, and George. We sing happy birthday to you and may all your dreams come true. Happy, happy birthday. Can you believe we're taking the Terra Nova test today? Yes, and we also have two eighth grade students that have plenty of experience taking tests and are here to share test-taking tips with us. Hello, I'm Daniela, and here we have Alexia to give us some testing tips. What do you do to prepare the night before a big test? It's important to go to bed early and get a good night's sleep, at least eight hours. You should also have a healthy breakfast in the morning for extra brain power, something like eggs, fruit, non-sugary cereal, and milk. Avoid sugary food because it can just make you sleepy. What are some test-taking tips you can give us? Be sure that you listen and follow the test directions read by your teacher. Read each question carefully. Look over all the choices before you answer them, then eliminate the answers that you know are wrong. How about if you get stuck on a question and you don't know the answer? The Terra Nova tests are timed, so it's important not to spend so much time on one question. Just skip it and go back to it later. You should still try to answer every question with your best choice even if you don't know the answer. If you finish early, you can go back and check your work. 
What's your best advice for answering questions in the reading sections? For stories or reading passages, you should always skim the questions before you read the story so you can search for answers as you read. How about some tips for math and dealing with numbers? In math, it's important to make sure to line up the numbers correctly when working out the problems on scrap paper. And always remember to fill in the bubbles neatly and completely. Don't worry, do your best and God will do the rest. Those are some great tips. Thank you for your help. No problem. Good luck, everyone. In sports news, our JV girls basketball team beat St. Thomas in a very close game, winning with a score of 9-8. to eight. They went undefeated all season for eight games straight, making them the division champions for the second year in a row. Congratulations, girls, and go Eagles! That's all for today. Good luck on your test. God bless, bless you, you and make, make it a fabulous, fabulous Friday. Friday. That's all, folks.